this week's Student Athlete Spotlight profiles dual sport athlete Tom Flacco, who plays both football and baseball at Towson. After stops at Western Michigan and Rutgers, Flacco arrived on campus last fall and, as a redshirt junior, led Rob Ambrose's squad to the NCAA playoffs for the first time since 2013. He passed for 3,251 passing yards with 28 touchdowns and rushed for a team-best 742 yards. He earned the Colonial Athletic Association Offensive Player of the Year honors and finished fifth in the Walter Payton Award voting. To say he hit the ground running would probably be an insult to how fast he was running. That he was a sponge. He sucked up every single piece of information he could get about our scheme, our coaches, and our players. And then he decided that he was going to do what he did, which was win. And not games, days, hours, events, whatever you asked him to do academically or athletically, he was going to win it and he was going to drag people along with him. Once I got to Towson and I saw the wide receivers that we had and we were working in the summer, saw them, I saw the, the running backs that we had as a unit are, are ridiculous. And I saw that how hard the offensive line worked. As in the summer when I realized like we could be special here at Towson and I think that's what the work that we had in the, in the off season really showed on, during the season. This spring, Flacco is playing baseball for the Tigers, a sport he hasn't played since his senior year of high school. He began the season with 10 hits in his first 25 plate appearances and is a perfect 10 for 10 in steal attempts while serving as the primary right fielder for Matt Tyner's team. He has a different set of expectations than, than probably uh, the majority of our players in that his level is here based off of the amount of success he's had in football and he brings that with him on the baseball field. He brings that mentality to our dugout into the field of play. So when I mention the Flacco effect, it, there is really one. I mean, when he's doing well, we're better. I mean, we are, we're just better. It's a different team. Trying to bring value to the team. That's what I told Coach Tyner when I try to get on the team. I just want to bring value in some way. And I think I'm doing that, so hopefully I can bring more value in the next coming weeks. After earning a degree at Rutgers, Flacco is pursuing a master's in applied information technology at Towson. Both coaches believe the best is yet to come for the youngest of the six Flacco siblings. He's a leader, he's a hard worker, he raises the level of play of everyone around him and it really doesn't matter the sport or the topic. I wish I had 100 of them. For all the gaudy and exceptional statistics that he has, the highest quality and compliment that I can give him is that he would sell them all for his team to win. We well, always preach work-life balance. Well, if you can see a guy doing two, not one sport, and be able to pull it off and be reasonably successful at it, and no telling how successful he'll be next fall, that's a, that's a testament, you know, to what it actually takes. I'm not satisfied yet, you know. I mean, we still have another season of football left. We have another couple of weeks of baseball where we can definitely make a make a dent in things. So. No, I mean, like I said, I expected to be where I'm at. I, I'm happy that I'm at Towson because, I mean, everybody, it's, it's crazy how the Flacco name runs in Baltimore, even though he's, Joe's now gone. But I, hopefully I can just, I'm Tom Flacco, you know, not Joe's brother.